The only way to really start this speech, in the words of Beyonce herself, guys, she put a ring on it. <laughs> um, so on behalf of me and my wife, I'm gonna say that so much. Um, thank you so much. You've all traveled so far, and made such a monumentous effort to uh, be with us today. And seeing you all here, it truly shows to us, and I know my wife would agree, um, we're so lucky. So normally fathers would say a few words about the lovely bride, but as Laura's sister, I hope I can do our dad proud by representing him today. Our parents modelled what a great love is through thick and thin and ups and downs, an everlasting love for each other and their family. These are the values that Lara has been looking for and I know has found them in Dean. Dad would be extremely proud and happy. Lara is the kindest, patient and loving person and she's truly a best friend as well as an amazing sister. There's obviously one person here whose absence was mentioned earlier on, and that is of Lara's father, Roy. Now, I never got to meet Roy, unfortunately, um, but I feel like I do know him. I will do him proud. I will do Dorothy proud. And if anyone doesn't know, the ring that I'm wearing today is Roy's wedding ring. So that I am honored to wear this. I, Dean Trendler. Take you, Lara Amblo. Take you. <laughs> Deep breath. <laughs> Lara Amblo. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. I, Lara Amblo. Take you, Dean Trendler. Take you, Dean Trendler. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Lara and Dean, so I am delighted to announce that you are now legally married, husband and wife. Maybe that kiss is in order. Lara, I think the one thing I want to say to you is what makes us, us. It's the seaside walks, it's being brunch buddies, it's being snuggle buddies, and it's being partners in crime. I'm so proud of you. I couldn't be more honored to call you my wife. And I just know our adventures together are gonna to be amazing. So ladies and gentlemen, please raise a glass to again, the love of my life, the woman I'm so proud to call my wife, Lara. Lara is my oldest uh, friend. Well, in fact, she's not. She's not old. She's she's actually my my best friend in the world. I'm so grateful to be here, um, sharing in your special day. So thank you so much for for having me, and thank you to all of you for coming to help celebrate this beautiful day. And I know it means the absolute world to them that you're here and to be surrounded by all their nearest and dearest. Uh, today. They say if a true friendship is one where you can pick up almost exactly where you left off, no matter how much time has passed. And so when Laura rang me all those years ago, excited to tell me all about the well-fit, rock star guitar playing boy she'd started seeing from work, <laughs> I, <laughs> I couldn't wait to meet him. Dean's laid-back, easy-going charm complemented Lara's fizzy, imaginative nature beautifully. I am so happy for you both that you found your one, your true love, and your happy ever after. As Dean's best man and lifelong friend, I feel privileged to stand here before you and share some heartfelt words about this extraordinary couple. 
According to Dean, it was love at first sight. He claims he was mesmerized by Lara's radiance and captivated by her charm. So Lara and Dean, as you embark on this incredible journey called marriage, know that you have an army of loved ones cheering you on. May your adventures together be filled with laughter, surprises, and the occasional plot twist. Remember the uncharted paths that often lead to the most remarkable destinations. So ladies and gentlemen, please stand, raise your glasses, to Dean and Laura.